Hi everybody, today I'm, uh, I'm going to show you how simple it is to create an animation with CA replicator layer. CA replicator layer is a really obscure layer inside of the, the, the layer sub, 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 subclasses. And in particular, I will show you how to create a custom uh, activity indicator in a very few steps. So everything starts with a source layer. We define a rectangle, we give him a background, in this example, Y background, and then through CA replicator layer, we'll end up having a full circle of this source layer replicated. How cool is that? It's really cool and it's really simple. Uh, but before seeing the code, let's, let's have a look at how the layer hierarchy is, uh, is in our case. So let's suppose we have a custom view and we will have our replicator layer as sublayer of the of our of our layer view, and then the we, we should think the replicator layer has a container layer that will replicate every sublayers on of its of its of its layer. Uh, so we our source layer we added as as sublayer of 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 the replicator. It's very, very important when we create a replicator layer to set its bounds in, in position in order to overlap completely the super layer. So set its bounds to the bounds of the super layer and its position in order to be centered in its super layer. Uh, a source layer, no magic, we create a, a rectangle, we give them a color, and also here it's important, define its position. As we know, we define position of layer through position and, and anchor point. And then we add it as sub-layer of the, of the replicator layer. Next, how do we tell to the CA replicator layer how many uh, replicas you should, you should do? Well, replicator layer has a, has, a, has a property which is called instance count, which accepts an integer that specifies how many copies you want, including the source, the source la la layer. Uh, but then you can also spe specify an instance matrix in order to, to tell to replicator layer how to transform the the current layer from the previous layer. So in our case, we want to we want to a, a, a rotation from the previous layer. We define an angle, and then each instance will be will be shifted by by this angle. Uh, till now, we don't have any animation yet. We st we will have the the full circle of of rectangle. Um, a replicator layer defines another property, which is called instance delay, which defines a time offset between the creation of each single of the replicas. Uh, we, we, we just assign um, a delay to, the, to, this, to, to, to these properties, and then we can, we can combine it with CA basic animation. In our case, uh, we want to animate the opacity of each, of each replicas, so we define a basic animation with the opacity, which uh, will range from one to zero. We're giving the same duration of the, of the instance delay, and also we want it to be, to be infinite, so we assign float infinity to repeat count. And then we just add it to the, as, a, as an animation of the, of the source layer, and you have your custom animator in a very few steps. Thank you very much. Thank you.